disagree with her. I bet that title's caught your interest. Now, most of you are probably far too scared to rock the boat. And most of you probably never get laid either. So why should you disagree with her? I'm not saying being a disagreeable prick all the time. Well, you should definitely disagree with her. Whether it be serious or playful. And I'll explain why in this video. So stick around. King D back with another one. And this video is called Disagree With Her. Now why should you disagree with her? Well. Well. It shows that you got your own mind. And now that is attractive. If you're just going to agree with everything she ever says. Then you're just showing her that you're a follower. And you got it. That's right. The ladies. They want a leader. So lead. And what else? Why else should you disagree with her? I will get on to the playful part shortly. But why else should you disagree with her? Well, it demonstrates good boundaries now, doesn't it? Now, why is that important? Well, well, if you've got strong boundaries, what does that tell her? It shows her that you know your worth and you ain't putting up with no bullshit. And you ain't going to bend over backwards for her. Just because she's pretty and has a vagina. Which shows an abundance mindset. Which is also very attractive. You're happy to let her go. Bye then, Neil. All the best. If you're going to agree with everything she ever says, it just shows her that you're a yes man and you're just trying to please her. And that also suggests that she's better than you are. So I'm not saying... Just disagree with her for the fun of it. Although you can playfully, which I, like I said, I will get to shortly. We well, you know, sometimes these ladies, they're in the wrong. And sometimes, and I've brought this up before as well, she's testing you. She wants you to disagree with her because she knows she's, whatever coming out of her mouth is bullshit. So don't be afraid to say no. Don't be afraid to have a difference of opinion. It's good. If you agreed on everything all the time, it's going to get pretty dull, isn't it? Now, I know myself, I've had ladies where they're trying to be very agreeable with me. They just want to go along with me all the time. And it gets to a point where it's like, oh, I like rock music. And she's like, oh, I like rock music too. And I'm thinking, yeah, there's a surprise. We ever had an original thought, Duck? And the ladies, they're way more pickier than the majority of men because they can afford to be. So, it's going to bore her. It is. So, getting to the playful part, anyway. I think this is important. I really do. So, say she likes, I don't know, whatever she likes. Turn it around on her and just say, Oh dear, I don't. I think it's crap. Whether you like it or not. Now, this is the, the fun part where you can be playful. And say if she's got a hobby... You know, I don't know. Say she likes fishing. Shit example, because there's not many birds that like fishing now, is there? But we're going to use it anyway. Because it's irrelevant. She turns around to you and says, I like fishing. It's enjoyable. You can turn around and go, Fishing? What's up with you? And then follow on with something like, Fishing's for losers. Whether you think that or not, now she's, and she knows you're taking the piss. You can start having a bit of back and forth. Playful. Much more entertaining than, oh, I like fishing. Oh, do you? That's good. What else do you like? Oh, I also like, uh, I like playing badminton. Oh, do you? That's great. What else? Oh, I like watching Netflix as well. Oh, do you? That's fantastic. I like Netflix as well. Oh, do you? Yeah, what programmes do you like watching on Netflix? Oh, I like a bit of that Breaking Bad. Do you, Duck? I love Breaking Bad. I think it's brill. Oh, do you? Yeah, I do, Duck. What else do you like? Oh, I like a bit of that Sons of Anarchy as well. Do you? I think it's brill. What else do you like? Oh, I like the Kardashians. Do you? Oh, I've not watched it, but it looks very, very good. I'd love to watch that with you. Really? Yeah. 
Do you see where I'm going with this? No. Now, if she turned around and said, I like the Kardashians, you turn around to her and say, What the fuck is wrong with you, Dilk? Sort yourself out. And she'll turn around and go something like, oh, What do you mean? And you can have a bit of back and forth. Much more entertaining than just nodding and agreeing with everything she says. So I hope this video helps anyway. And just remember, it's okay to disagree with her. It's perfectly fine. Sometimes she wants you to. Because either she's taking the piss out of you intentionally because she's testing you. She wants to see what you're all about. She wants to see that you've got a backbone as well. And that you've got your own mind that thinks for itself. That's very attractive. A leader can think for himself. A follower does not. A follower just goes, yeah, whatever, to whatever is being said. And the ladies, they want a leader. Someone that thinks for themselves. Someone who has a backbone. And a sense of humour. So disagree with her playfully as well. Take the piss, it's much more entertaining. That's right. But if she turns around to you and says that she thinks King D's brilliant and it's the best YouTube channel on YouTube, you can agree with her then. That's a green flag right there. So like, comment and subscribe. And be the best you. And do it for you. Cheers. Oh, I like watching Netflix as well. Oh dear, that's fantastic. I like Netflix as well. Oh dear. Yeah, what programs do you like watching on Netflix? Oh, I like a bit of that Breaking Bad. Do you, Duck? I love Breaking Bad. I think it's brill. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh, do you? Yeah, I do, Duck. What else do you like? Oh, I like a bit of that Sons of Anarchy as well. Do you? I think it's brill. What else do you like? Oh, I like the Kardashians. Do you? Oh, I've not watched it, but it looks very, very good. I'd love to watch that with you. Really? Yeah. You see where I'm going with this?